I'm gonna try the, the black one to campus that one. So the lift is uh, where we're gonna use the film today. Uh, we're gonna try, all right, I'm gonna try the hardest route in the gym currently. It's an eight day plus. I've done all the other hard routes here, but not this one. I think that it's actually a lot harder than eight day plus. Uh, I've fallen on the crux like, probably like five times. And actually fun fact is that I have a lift certificate. Uh, <laughs> That's uh, something that not a lot of people know about me. If the YouTube thing doesn't work out, I have something to fall back on, you know? <laughs> I don't know, it's been a, like a requested video on this channel to try ice climbing and I think lead climbing is like good training for ice climbing because I know that it's super pumpy. You wouldn't think so because you like hold on to jugs the whole time, but it's actually really pumpy. After Adam said that he always warms up with autobelaying, I've also done the same. And actually my body feels really good today. I feel strong. Because I've tried it so many times, so I feel like I actually have to try to be serious for this one. Yeah. Belaying is important. <laughs> it's like the other times I've been short rope a little bit. <laughs> Not so if just you, a little bit. <laughs> we have to work as a team here. Is it like croxy or is it? It's pretty croxy, yeah. Okay. The first three draws are easy and then it gets really hard up until the second to last draw before the roof. Okay. And then it's pretty easy again. Just the, the clipping positions feel really awkward. Okay, so you might, you might fall. Yeah, I might clipping. fall while clipping. Okay. I'm not planning on it though. You nervous? It's just, I know it's gonna be painful. Yeah. My forearms are gonna hurt. So the next three draws is definitely the crux, I would say. Uh, it starts with a sketchy bump and it feels like if you just miss this with just a little bit, you will fall. Clipping the next draw also takes a lot of power. None of the holes are facing just straight down and it makes it really awkward. And uh, these moves I've fallen quite a few times on. This part makes the end of the crux. A dead point move up to a crimp, get the feet back on the wall and throw yourself to the semi jump. <gasps> I would say that the rest of the route is just pumpy with no real crux.
I honestly never thought I would do that. Like, I had to run the whole way because my endurance is not that good, but I feel really strong at the moment. Guys, right, thank you for the belay. That was good. It was a team effort. Okay, I can load all the way. I think I gotta do one more route because uh, I didn't expect this one to go so easy. I thought I would try like a couple of times. So I'm gonna try it. There's a white one. It's a shorter route. It's 8A plus only up to the first anchor. I mean, you should also set yourself a goal, like, because you've done 6C, the next goal should be 6C plus, and 7A, like, that would be really cool if you could climb 7A. It's kind of like a goal for 2022, maybe? Yeah. To do like a 7A? Yeah, our new year res resolution is to uh, stop with caffeine. So I've stopped drinking coffee. I've been like two weeks without it now. And I feel a lot healthier, to be honest. Yeah and you sleep a lot better. But I feel like it's at the same time though, like not having the, like your morning coffee kind of removes the, some sparks of your life. So. But anyways, do you feel safe? Um, as I'm belaying you? I, I, I short rope you a little bit. But. Yeah, but I feel very safe, yeah. Okay. Sometimes it almost feels safer when you're short roped, you know? If you don't, if you're not short roped at all, then you don't know like, if there's okay, anyone at the end of the rope, What you know? are you doing right now? Yeah, Is the pump got away. No, the pump is still there, okay. but I'm going to try regardless. That's what I want. You know, that's, I've, I've said this before, but I feel like the difference for me uh, from being in shape and not in shape is that when I'm in shape, I have many good tries. When I'm not in shape, I have one good try. So I just had my one good try and now it's probably going to go like this. It takes a little bit more like effort to lead climb. You know, you need a partner, you need a rope and everything. But when I do it, I just feel so good. I don't know. It's, yeah, it gives me a better feeling than bouldering. I think I actually onsided that one, but now I was just really pumped, so I had no chance, but it was a good fight. I think to end things off though, I'm gonna try a root campus. I'm gonna try to campus this whole 7A and go through the roof and everything just to finish this session off. So 6P plus to the first anchor and 7A all the way up. I tried doing this, uh, or the just. Oh, six. yeah, this is your project. <laughs> My right. project uh, on Friday, and I didn't, I wasn't able to do it, and now you're just gonna <laughs> camp it. it. So, um. It's a good thing that we've been together for quite a while now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs>
you, you know me by now. If this was <laughs> the first know. date and I campused your project. <laughs> Have you ever done that though, or like on purpose? Or if it, no. you're climbing with someone <laughs> no. that you don't like, then you're just gonna... Campus there, no, that would be really <laughs> douchey. <laughs> it's, not, it's not graded for campusing, you know, it's so... Yeah. Uh, <laughs> like a, a 7C can be easier to campus than a 7A, if it's just, it depends on the style. Okay. I think, I think this one should be okay though, but there are a couple of moves that I think can potentially be pretty hard. So much further than you think, or than I think. Oh, no. This is hard. Yeah. It's really hard. <laughs> oh. oh, that was really far. It was pretty close. It's those undercling moves, you know? As long as it's like left, right, left, right, it's okay, but as soon as you get an undercling and you can't use your foot, it's like so hard. Uh, but uh, yeah, I don't know. It's uh, pretty happy about that. And uh, the next video is probably gonna be from Bergen uh, with Pete. Uh, so that's exciting. Um, also comment down below if you want Marta to try a 7A. Uh, make sure to like and subscribe and I will see you next time.